Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, there was a terrible shooting today in Sao Paulo, Brazil, where up to 10 people were killed. And then the, the two suspects were wearing hoods, like hoodies, and then they suicided. They killed themselves. On our channel, we show how all of the world is going along as a matrix, right by the Bible and that everything's we're nearing the biblical end times and that we're in this time now of the dragon and this dragon Satan can possess people drive you mad and insane to go kill we have been showing this all around the world we have tracked thousands of murders around the world all done by this evil spirit after the children and bringing terror it just corrupts people's minds the same as the Columbine shooting in the USA, the exact same thing as the Stone Man Douglas high school shooting that happened in Florida in 2018 with 17 people killed. See this number? 17, 17, 17, 17. The beast is rising. We are fighting the woman on the beast, the beast from the bottomless pit these ten kings and they're going after Jesus and after the children and the dragon was wroth with the woman see the 17 and the dragon was wroth with the woman and went to make war with the remnant of her seed which keep the commandments of God and have the testimony of Jesus Christ this evil spirit is going around the world causing these killings one of the biggest signs is the suspect will suicide out. The man that did this shooting in Florida said he heard voices in his head and that he wanted to suicide, but he didn't do it. We have tracked these all around the world, this thing, especially the reason for Brazil will be shown because of the brawl. It actually represents the coming of the Lord Jesus Christ. It's all right in front of us. Notice today the word Elizabeth right at the top. Mm -hmm. The woman riding the beast. This, this symbolism is all around the world. You are in the middle of a universal war for the children's souls. Well, one of the things that we do to prove this is we help fulfill scripture. Where it talks of in the book of Acts that at the end times you will see signs in the heavens and on the earth. We're going to go over to Sao Paulo, Brazil, and map this out and show this beast. The beast out of the sea, the dragon with seven heads and ten horns and the feet of a bear. And that this was actually a sign to all of us about the brawl and them going after the children. It happened in this one area called Susano. You can make your references to that as you wish. It, it's, the symbolism does not stop with these things. The fallen angels are the same as aliens in UFO ships. The exact same thing. That's what it says in the Bible. The fallen angels descended. It's the same thing. It's alien tech going on all around the world. Well, here's Sao Paulo, Brazil, and there's Susano. It will map out what exactly we've been showing on our channel before. This beast, it loves to kill the children. Can you see the bear right here? And then you can you see what looks like a pope right at Susano. This is a picture of the beast. It's not a joke. It's called one of the horns. See how the bear has a horn? Seven heads and ten horns. See the horn? Right at Susano. If you don't believe in spirits, this can be done by technology. 
This is mapped out at the large CERN Hadron Collider in Europe, the largest machine on the whole planet. Head-on collider. It messes with your heads. The man that did this shooting said he heard voices in his head telling him to kill and then to kill himself. That's what's happened here. Ten kids or so killed and the suspects killed. It's right there. There it is. See how it's mapped out? See the bear right there? Right at Susano? Well, let's go ahead and show this at the CERN Large Hadron Collider, how they can talk into people's heads. Here is the CERN Large Hadron Collider, like a head-on collision. There's even talk of maybe time travel and portals to be opened for demon spirits so that they can feed upon the children. Don't forget, these things consider human beings like money. See, they're, they're going after the remnant of the seed of God. That's what they're going after, see? To make war with the remnant of her seed, meaning the children. And she brought forth a child who was to rule all nations. That's what Satan is after. The second coming of Jesus Christ and all of his saints. Well, here's CERN, the Large Hadron Collider right over here. You can see the pyramid, which is the basics of the fallen angels, known as the burdens of Egypt. And right here you can see the bear. There it is, the same picture. And here is the woman or the whatever riding the beast right at the top. See right there? And they are the serpent. There's the serpent. And they're known as the horns. See the dragon? It's the dragon going after the children all around the world as we've shown. That's the exact same picture that is mapped out right where the shooting just happened. And we've tracked this around before. We'll do this real quickly. Let's go over to the Stone Man Douglas High School shooting. This is mean with all of these images it means God is showing us that the battle is on. The end times could happen in any moment or any year. So let's head over here to Florida, to this shooting. We're going to see this over at the Stone Man Douglas place. The beast out of the sea, with the feet of the bear going after the children. This controls nearly all of the world. All of the world governments. Yes, it's real. Read your Bible. If you're thinking about what about the other religions, the other religions like Islam and such, are all made by these ten fallen angels so that they can get a kingdom they get worship kingdoms like all of the Muslims worshiping the black stone in Mecca represents these guys sitting in some type of kingdom that that's what it represents they steal the worship energy fallen angels well here's where the stone man Douglas high school is right here and you can see the beast out of the sea the shark See the shark? There's the shark going right after the kids. Seventeen children were killed right there. And the person that did this said he heard voices in his head and it told him to suicide. Kill, destroy, then suicide. That's what happened here the suspects ended up suiciding themselves at the end. They're mind controlled. It comes down to even your mind. It's in the Bible. It's on your one dollar bill. The pyramid. These have one mind and shall give their power and strength unto the beast. It corrupts your mind. That's what we've shown on our channel. It's something to do with the food and the water all around the world now. Almost like an alien invasion of symbiotes. That's what the fall, it's angels. Fallen angels. The same thing as an alien or a demon. No different. That if you see UFOs, 
It's fallen angels. That's what those things are. We can see the evidence. They're controlling the world. Even have this is the largest machine on the whole planet. It, it's it, it encompasses a couple of countries. Look how big it is. See that, and that's a gateway for whatever they're bringing through, and messing with people's minds, controlling presidents, just like a Donald Trump. It clicks on to Donald Trump. Donald Trump tweets a bunch of weird stuff. It, that's it. It clicks on to the Queen of England. They, they control the Pope. They run over to China and control him. It, it, they just click right into their mind and control the guy like an avatar. That's what it amounts to. There it is. So let's head back down to Sao Paulo. So everybody down in Sao Paulo, just, just come to the Lord Jesus. The devil is hunting the saints. It encompasses all the world. Read your Bible. Every country, every world ruler is controlled by Satan. That's what it says in the Bible. And if you think like an Obama would save you, then a Trump would save you, that's him tricking everyone. Look at right at the top of the page. Elizabeth, Queen Elizabeth. We've tracked this right over to England and the princes, which is part of the Ten Horns. And to the Vatican, China, Russia. Jesus is the only way. Drop whatever you got and run to him. This thing is hunting. This is Satan. Look at him right there. And as I've said before, if you don't believe in angels and things, uh, this thing is using technology to kill. See, that's one of the horns. There he is. Thank you very much, everybody. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. And may God have mercy on everyone over here and the terror that this thing brings. It likes to rip and tear families apart. It's on a giant scale. It, it likes to cause divorce. It, it, it just You see in what it's done to the Catholic Church with the pedophilia. and it, That's the way it tricks people. God have mercy.